Alright, so I'm here right now with the microtome machine. What we're doing right now is we're sectioning pieces of mouse lung. This is the lung embedded in paraffin wax. Just put it in right here. And right here there's a really thin blade that can slice into four micron slices. Right now I just need to trim off a lot of excess and I just crank this right here to get the slicing going. Right now it's trimming big chunks like 20 microns. Oh and I get this really nice little paintbrush to help wipe off the wax bits. So I need to keep on slicing much like a deli slicer at your grocery store until I get to the middle of the section where I can get a really nice uh, planar surface area for us to see of the mouse lung. So now I need to breathe a lot of moist air onto the wax so it can soften it just enough so that when I quickly slice it, it's nice and smooth. Okay, so the first time that I cranked it wasn't so good, but I think the second time looks a little bit better. But I need to really carefully take it off. Now I just stick it on the side. So here's the slice. It's a little bit crinkly right now, but that's okay. Okay, I just put it in the water, which is this little bin right here. Here's just a positively charged microscope slide. It's just positively charged, so then the tissue can adhere onto the slide a little bit better. Yeah, you can see the sample right here. There's still lots of wax all around, but that can be easily taken off with the deparaffinization step next time that I need to use the slide. I'll just let it sit right here and then wait for it to dry a little bit and all the slides stay overnight on here to warm and really dry it out before I put it away or start staining. I'm actually going to be doing some immunohistochemistry tomorrow with it. And I take a lot of samples, usually six or seven per sample, because we perform a lot of different types of staining procedures on it.